And we are back, continuing with the last version of Breath Edge left off. I don't think there's anything else to do here, but I do want to look around. If I don't get caught. Fuck that. Wow, that's a whole kernel. Or perhaps he's not quite whole. In any case, a government suit of such a level should be equipped with a good oxygen cylinder. Unfortunately, the cylinder is badly damaged. Ah, that is a turret. Shit. Gotta turn this thing off somehow. There it is. Oh, well, now we got another cell, so... Ah, thing, yes. Of course it's fucking empty. The bike. Pop an air cylinder. I mean, we are super close. The usual cosmic nutrition, but with flavoring and stuffed into an expensive package. Holy shit. Looks like a cabin of an annoying neighbor with a drill. Anything else I can grab here? Ooh, a lamp. To the bike. Then down there. Is that a coffin? Looks like a coffin. It is a coffin. It's empty. On such old docking airlocks, there must be some detailed information on how to assemble, maintain, and repair them. Probably. Well, here goes nothing. I mean, that might be enough to destroy one of the things, but not both of them. my bike it's below me I feel like it's below me but I need some of this first damn it the bikes below me 
Okay. Grab whatever metal I can, go back to base, and see what I can do. And I'll come back here later. Goddamn robots shooting up my health bar. Grab the other two from earlier. Now what I want to do, I want to make a new suitcase. Okay, and that's done. back over there and see what's out there. Well, we know what's out there. A shit ton of metal, actually. And this. I saw this the other way. Let's look in here. Still empty. A number of random objects. There's no logical connection. Analysis required. After the 12th Space Congress, at which the mug was proclaimed a vessel for the proletariat, cups were banned and their production stopped. You can get a fine or sense it's... It's unclear if it was placed in the teapot on purpose or it got stuck there itself due to progressive obesity. The standard funerary set doesn't include such a color. Just vinegar, a tea bag, and two pieces of sugar. No such tea recipe was found in the database. Now it's clear how to pass the medical checkup. Okay. Uh, 
A rare device to approximately tell the time. My internal clock crashed during the incident, but even being broken, it shows the time much more accurately once per day. And then we'll get over there and grab what we need. Huh. Ah, more metal that I missed. Great. Yeah, I've been in that blinking thing before. Metal. Shit, that's broken. Any more? I thought there was one more ball. There's, yeah, there is one more ball. Okay. I got this. Maybe. Fuck. Okay, well now assuming there's no more balls, and my bike just didn't drift off. It's there, good. Time to use the rest of this thing, and not die. Okay, well, whatever this is, this is closest. A large part of the mayonnaise is frozen, but there is some strange activity in some of the balls. If it really is mayo, as indicated in the invoices. Looks like the mayo tanks weren't only on the port side. There's a chance to... I have no idea who would need that amount of mayo in space, but we need to find a way to get this whole thing into the liner's core to reduce its activity. It would be useful to have a powerful soil analyzer with the function of deep scanning, which is usually used by biologists and treasure hunters. Damn, well, I had it. This is working autonomous oxygen station. Cool. The victim may have tried to press the barbell with his Adam's apple, but this presumption may not be accurate. Sixteen kilograms of metal that never became the ship's plating. Motherfucker, stand still. Bodybuilding is a sports culture of the past. It died together with its followers because they loved to tear their spacesuit to demonstrate their muscles. Okay, well, if we can get back to the station. Can I make a soil analyzer? Did I 
have sworn I did. Well, can't pass someone on a free battery. Damn. After looking through the technical support application statistics, the agency decided to deal with the linearity of jokes in their spacesuits. Now you can always choose joke one or joke two if you buy a special breath edge two button game pad. I could have sworn I made an analyzer before. Way too much crap here. What the fuck was I trying to make? I can make another oxygen generator. That doesn't matter. Oxygen candle, aluminum, thick tape. Oxygen candle. Aluminum and thick tape. One aluminum. I was some more somewhere. No, did I? Guess not. Fuck, really? Okay. Oh, shit, I didn't grab the tape. Tape, 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 tape. Yep, cool, cool. Guess this is how we die. Okay, save. Go drop off two metal, and now we need more aluminum, so that's fucking amazing. Oh, let's bounce.
I didn't look for the analyzer. That's what I didn't do. Motherfucker. I wonder if I have to launch all three or just the one. Because it seems like chapter two is all about lowering radiation. Okay, is this a bubble? This is not a bubble. This, however, is. Nothing of interest. Nothing of interest. Nothing of interest. Fucking really? It would be useful to have a powerful soil analyzer with the function of deep scanning, which is usually used by biologists and treasure hunters. I am not sure about the composition of modern Mayo products, and therefore I advise you to be careful. Their current physical properties are unknown. Shit. Well, let's do this. Saves me the oxygen candles. Damn it. Oh, that's gonna suck. Yep, knew it. I'm just missing this one every direction. Analyze it. Nothing of interest. Fucking great. What about over here? Nothing of interest. Great, so we're just getting air bubbles. Fucking amazing. Good shit. Ooh, a large oxygen candle. Solids detected. A very odd composition, but apparently this mayo doesn't want to freeze. There's also no danger to the spacesuit's material, but I'm not sure it's reasonable to stay here with such visibility. In addition, the composition's density prevents you from moving quickly. Nothing of interest. Is there a door here? Nothing of interest. Well, it would be nice to see. Nothing of interest. <sighs> Nothing of interest. There? No, up there. Nothing of interest. Nothing of interest. This is An a door. Seems, to be Seems like the gas coming into the mayo doesn't let it freeze. 
Cool. I have a feeling that something is wrong with this mayonnaise. Apart from the inconsistency of its composition, overly complex technologies are used to transport such biological debris. Although, all the tanks are specified as mayonnaise ones in all the invoices related to the liner. Great, great, great. Save it here. This vacuum cleaner is called Rocket for a reason. With it having such a powerful engine, it is really possible to fly it if you bypass some technical limitations. Can I take Someone it with me? Someone clearly overestimated the value of the mayonnaise, allocating an autonomous tank for it equipped with an auto flight system. Although considering our situation, it's a great opportunity to launch it without any problems by fixing one of the engines and getting the tank with module. Oh, Doki, whatever you say, man. Unbelievable. This is heaven knows what, but it's certainly not a simple tank for storing food products. Somebody excited the mayonnaise and did science experiments. I wonder who. A detailed plan of the transport module. Shit, anything over here? Aside from this door that leads into that chamber. We Nope, I think we're good. is not mayonnaise, and the tank was an integral part of the systems of the liner unnamed. We have to start the centrifuge, even just out of scientific interest. Yeah, man, after I'm done looking. The data analysis on the crash of the liner and the nature of the damage allows a special patch and a bloated spacesuit indicating increased gas production due to excessive broccoli eating. All this points out that the body belongs to the Green Universe Radical Group. If the possible moral constraints are no problem, this bag of methane, hydrogen, and organic residues can be used to provide initial acceleration to the centrifuge. You only need to figure out how to do it. Okie dokie. Here we go. Looks like we need to go outside and check the tank engines. Well, okay, we did that. So I'm going to stop it here. With that, everybody, as usual, we've run out of time for this episode. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. And hopefully in the next one we can launch this weird space mayo jizz thing. And with that, I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye, everybody. See you later.